Lewis Hamilton launched a stinging attack on Red Bull, Christian Horner, and the FIA while staunchly backing Susie Wolf in her legal battle with motorsports governing body and hopes it will signal more transparency in Formula One. In 2023, the FIA launched an investigation into Wolf and her husband, Mercedes F1 team principal and CEO Toto, after allegations of confidential information being passed on by Susie, who works for F1 Management, FOM, as head of the F1 Academy series. However, after an immediate and heated backlash that included every F1 team making a coordinated show of support for Susie, who described the case as rooted in intimidatory and misogynistic behavior, a humiliated FIA dismissed the case less than 48 hours later. Ahead of the 2024 Australian Grand Prix, Wolf filed a criminal complaint against the FIA in France, alleging reputational damage. I'm incredibly proud of Susie. I think she's so brave, Hamilton told the media, and she stands for such great values. She's such a leader. And in a world where often people are silent, for her to be standing up is such a great message. I love that she's taken it out of this world, fighting it outside, because there is a real lack of accountability here within this sport, within the FIA, things that are happening behind closed doors. There is no transparency. There is really no accountability. And we need that. I think the fans need that. How can you trust the sport and what is happening here if you don't have that? So hopefully this stand that she's taken now will create change, will have a positive impact. After initially alluding to the Horner controversy only vaguely, Hamilton then made his point crystal clear by highlighting the difference between Wolf fighting her corner with the FIA and the way Red Bull have handled their investigation into inappropriate and controlling behavior against a female employee. Horner was cleared of any wrongdoing by the team who have failed to publish any details of their investigation including the specific complaints made, and remains in his post despite a damaging set of leaks showing messages and images allegedly sent by the team principal. However, the female complainant was suspended from her post at the team. We live in a time where the message is, if you file a complaint, you will be fired, Hamilton added, and that is a terrible narrative to be projecting to the world. So, especially when we're talking about inclusivity here in the sport, we need to make sure that we're staying true to the core values here. And especially for women, it's still a male-dominated sport.